it's a good day when it's a stitch fix day. So let's open my box and see what my stylist sent me this time. Hey fashion friends, welcome to my channel, Dress Like You Mean It. I'm Andrea and I like to do clothing subscription unboxings, shopping hauls, try-ons, some lifestyle unboxings. Um, if you like that kind of content, then I invite you to hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, please give me the thumbs up, like, leave me a comment, help me grow my channel. Okay, so Stitch Fix, um, I feel like everybody knows what Stitch Fix is. Um, I really do. So I'm not gonna go over that, but uh, they do send you a preview. And I did choose one thing for my preview and I, I'm regretting it a little bit. Um, I have a great stylist, her name is Marsha. She does a really wonderful job. And I had asked for a bomber jacket and I'm, you know, it's spring, I'm, I want spring colors. And one in my preview was black. It had an interesting looking texture and I went ahead and chose that. But when I was shopping recently, I realized that black is just not resonating with me right now because I want to, I want to have spring colors. So anyway, um, that was the only thing that I chose for my preview. All right, I've got two bundles in here. Stitch Fix does send you a return envelope that is um, prepaid postage. You get a note from your stylist and your price list. I always save the prices for last. And you get a bundle for two. And that might be the bomber jacket. And can you see it's got, it's like rib. And I thought it was gonna be more waffle. And then, ooh, we have got some pretty, pretty spring colors. I'm liking what I see there. All right, I wanna take a moment to just thank you for watching my video. I really do appreciate it. And I know you have lots of YouTubers you can watch. So when you spend some time watching mine, it really means a lot to me. All right, let's unbundle this bundle. Okay. So on top, we do have this bomber jacket and it is very lightweight. It's got a pretty rose gold zipper. Um, it's got uh, kangaroo pockets in the front and it's a nice lightweight. I like it actually. This is the, who makes this? This is the, it's made by Skechers, Ottoman hoodless hoodie jacket. And I don't like hoodies, so I like that it doesn't have a hood. All right. Okay, next on top, we have something by Nick and Zoe. And it's this really pretty, um, I would call that a light teal sweater. I think I asked for lighter sweaters. Um, Femme sleeve slub v-neck sweater in turquoise. They're calling this turquoise. I, I would agree with that. And it's got long cuff v-neck nice weight uh let's see what it's made of i'm mindfully made it says 70 percent cotton 30 percent acrylic hmm when i put it up i feel a little itchy i think that's the acrylic so we'll have to see i'll have to see how that feels on nick and zoe tends to be expensive so it's gonna have to be perfect all right, and then we've got a pair of Cosmic Blue Love. Um, they're uh, like a jogger style, and I had asked for nice joggers. It's also got the pocket. That's very on trend, and I'm not sure how I feel about that trend. It's pretty mauve color. I recently got rid of a pair of mauve jeans just because I decided um, I just didn't like the, they, they were kind of a washed out look. So it's got pockets on the back. It's got like some seaming there as well. And it says it's made of tinsel, which um, is a really nice material. So I'll try those on. It's different. It's different from what's in my closet. I did a survey today for Stitch Fix and they were asking about trends and things like that. And I am not one to do a you know buy a lot of trends I, I think i tend to stick with just a classic look 
because I like it and that works well for me. Okay, so another pair of joggers. These are Flag and Anthem Aerial Mid-Rise All-Day Jogger. I might have put these on my saved list. They look very long. They look super duper long. Um, they're very nice material. They feel kind of like Viore, when Viore is super expensive. Um, so I like that. And then, not loving this color. These are Thread for Thoughts Bex Panel Square Pocket Jogger. And this is like an olive green, and I, that's not a, uh, I'm pretty picky about greens, and this is not a, a green that I like. So it's got like some different material. The bottom part is like ribbed. That's an interesting detail. And then it's just got the drawstring and square pockets. All right. Well, I think those things look good. Let's go ahead and quick read the note from Marsha. Happy spring, Andrea. I hope that the weather is warming up in Colorado. We've been in the 60s the last few days and we're gonna get snow tonight. So um, that's March in Colorado. Uh, we had a, a big snowstorm a week ago. We got 18 inches. I see that you chose a really fun bomber jacket from Skechers to try from the Fix Preview. The copper zipper as a great contrast. It will be perfect for spring. I found a really pretty sweater from Nick and Zoe for you to consider. I know that it is pricey, but the style and color are perfect for spring. Try it with white jeans. I also added an array of joggers in different colors and fabrics for you to try with tees and other tops. I hope that you find a pair or two to keep. Try the light purple pair from Cosmic Blue Love with your dark purple sweater from Pink Clover from the February 14th fix. I wear that sweater a lot. I hope you enjoy finding fresh ways to wear these pieces, so I look forward to your feedback and watching your videos soon. All right, I'll show you my outfit of the day and then we'll try these things on. So today's outfit features the pants that I got from Stitch Fix by Cosmic Blue Love in this Barbie pink. And um, the shoes I got from Stitch Fix, those are Michael Kors. The tank underneath the sweater is a new day and the sweater is by Zara. So come up a little closer so you can see it. The, the tank is blue. I was a little worried. It's, it's almost like a periwinkle. I was a little worried I was gonna look like an Easter egg with the, the blue and the pink, but I think this is such a little bit that it's, it's okay. It works. So this is my outfit of the day. Let's try clothes on. So first up are the Cosmic Blue Love pants and they are a Stitch Fix exclusive. And I want to like these pants, but I don't think I do because they're giving me serious scrubs vibes. And I'm gonna come up close and we'll talk about the details. Okay, so I just paired them with my Aldo tennies. Um, they sit right below the belly button, so kind of a mid-rise. Um, they've got the pocket here, the pocket here, and the pockets here. So um, my husband said that there was like too much going on. Um, yeah, I like I like the jogger part. Like if if they just had not these pockets. If these pockets weren't here, I think I would like them better. It's just, they remind me of scrubs and it, it just, I think he's right. I think it's just too much going on. Tell me what you think. Um, I know that, again, this is very on trend, but when I see these pants with the, the pockets on the side, that cargo style, I, I can't say that I love it. And that's from the back. So I think these are gonna be a no. All right, let's try another pair. So these are the blue joggers and um, they are quite long. Um, I mean, not too long. They're comfortable, they're soft. They don't really do anything for me. I mean, these, these would not be joggers I'd wanna wear out of the house. You can see it's, uh, they're very high-waisted. My belly button is <laughs> there, so very high-waisted and it's got the pockets. Yeah, they, I mean, they'd be good for lounging around the house and, and that's about it, so that's. 
Okay, one more pair of joggers. Last pair of joggers. These are the ones that are by Threads for Thoughts and they're very comfortable, very soft. Uh, they hit me at a, a good place. They do not have the typical jogger bottom. They're just a straight edge and um, they have pockets, the drawstring. They're very thin. You can, you can see my underwear through them. Um, and that's, that always tells me that it's exceptionally thin because uh, the underwear I wear are pretty invisible under almost everything. So, um, yeah, I don't like the color and uh, I think they're too thin. So, all right, let's try on the Nick and Zoe sweater and the bomber jacket. Next up, we have the Nick and Zoe sweater in this pretty green, I think they called it turquoise color. And I paired it with white jeans. I think that's what she had suggested. It actually feels fine. The acrylic is, is not itchy. It has this um, kind of pleated detail at the shoulders. Nice V-neck. It's, it's thin, which, you know, I had asked for thin sweaters. Um, it's pretty. It feels good. It's a nice spring color. It will come down to price on this because like I said, Nick and Zoe is very expensive generally. And I will have to decide if I love it enough for what I know the price is gonna be. What do you think? All right, let's try on this bomber jacket. So this is the jacket and it is a, you know, nice jacket. It's nice material. I do like that. She called it copper, I called it rose gold. The neck is a little high, comes up when you zip it up, it, it, it is. And I generally, you know, I, I wouldn't zip it all the way up because I don't like to bring attention to my wrinkly neck. It's not exactly what I was thinking when I, I thought of a bomber jacket, but depending on the price, it might be something that I want to add to my wardrobe because I don't have anything like this. Let me know in the comments what you think and let's do prices and a recap. Okay, that was a good fix. I was happy with the, the choices. Um, I, you know, well, let's just get to it. Um, before I forget, if you haven't tried Stitch Fix, I will leave my link below um, in the description box and the first pinned comment with my link that will give you $25 off your first fix and I'll get $25 credit too, so win-win. And if you've ever used my links, I really do appreciate it. So first up, we have uh, the Nick and Zoe sweater, and this is, <laughs> they're calling it on there light blue, and on here they're calling it turquoise. That's funny. I, I don't see that as blue, but anyway, it's $128 which is not surprising because like I said, Nick and Zoe is pricey. I just have to decide if, if I liked it $128 worth. Um, I like it. I like it a lot. I just am not sure I wanna spend that much on it. So next up we have the Flag and Anthem Ariel Mid-Rise All Day Jogger in light blue. These are $44. And I mean, that's, you know, that's a good price for a pair of joggers. I'm going to send these back though, because I, I just didn't think they were awesome. I didn't think they did anything for me. They're nice and soft. They're a good price, but I, it's not something that I know I would ever wear out of the house. And I'm not sure I would pull for them that often in the house. Cosmic Blue Love Philippa Midrise Crop Jogger. These are $98 and these are definitely going back. I just did not like the pockets on the sides like that. They just, honestly, if they hadn't had those pockets, I, I might consider keeping them, but they do, so I'm not. And then we have the Thread for Thought, Bex panel square pocket, joggers in green. These are $68, didn't like the color. Um, what else didn't I like about them? Just don't like the color. And then last we have the bomber jacket by Skechers and this is $49. And I'm considering it. I don't 
I don't feel super excited about it, so chances are good that I'm gonna send that back too. Sometimes that happens with the fix, you know, it's, I was looking forward to trying everything on, but the only thing I think I'm, I'm strongly considering is the Nick and Zoe sweater. So we'll have to see how it goes, um, whether or not I wanna spend that much on that sweater. That's a lot, that's, <laughs> that's a lot. I think like if, if like over a hundred, I always really gives me pause. Okay, I'm, I'm inserting this because I forgot to do it when I was going over the prices. The stylus pick subtotal was $387. If you keep all five items, you do get a 25% discount, which would take off $96.75, bringing the box down to $290.25, which is a, a kind of a pricey box. Okay, back to our regular scheduled programming. All right. Let me know what you thought of this fix. Let me know how your fixes are going. If you haven't tried Stitch Fix, use my link and give it a try. And let's see, I am going this next following week. It'll be, I mean, you'll see it at a different time. Anyway, spring break for my daughter this coming up week. So she is staying in town and we're gonna go for a girl's day of shopping one day. So hopefully I'll get some things there to show to you. And if you like this video, please give me the like. And if you haven't subscribed, I hope you will. I'm getting really close to a thousand. Um, it's taken me forever to grow this channel. Um, yeah. All right. Until next time, fashion friends, don't forget to dress like you mean it.